Hi, Ari, it's Travson here, and welcome back to our Adventures in New World. Last episode, we did some PvP quests in Brightwood, and we got our mining to level 50. Today, we are going to be crafting some tools to get some of our professions up. So first, let's go to the tannery. The main reason why I'm doing this is because we are running out of space in our storage, so... I think this will be a good way to lower the weight a little bit. You can also make rugged leather now. Let's put some tannin in there. We'll make a bunch of rugged leather. There we go. Okay, so let's go. And we will head over to... Oh, we got a territory standing in Brightwood. I don't, uh, I guess trading tax maybe or storage. So we'll go with trading tax. Or the trading tax a little bit. Okay, so let's go smelt some iron. Let's see how much iron we got. A decent amount of iron. Let's go smelt all that. Our iron up to 54. Let's check out our silver ingots. We'll smelt those. Not bad. Okay, so we smelted everything. We've got all our iron ingots. Now let's head over to the workshop. And let's uh, see how our tools are looking. It's going to break soon. Looks like our skinning knife's going to break. So let's make... Uh, some skinny knives, some iron skinny knives. We'll add some Azoth to that, 15. And we'll craft, uh, we can only craft two. Two 19's not bad. Durable. Skinning yield, 12% more. It's not bad. Okay, so I uh, wonder why we can only make that many. Skinning knives, is there a reason why? Well, now we can make more. Okay, so let's make a couple more. Oh, man. Did we add Azoth to that? I think we did. I don't think we did, yeah. Well, at least we're getting our engineering up. So we'll salvage that, that, that. This one's not bad. Azoth's extraction, that's good. No, we haven't really had any problems with Azoth. That's a pretty good skinning knife. And... Whew, what else we got here? What else is going to break down soon? Looks like our sickle's going to break down. So we'll make a harvesting sickle. I think we'll make like ten... Put some Azoth in there. Hopefully we get a good one. What happened there? Are, are we... Did we run out of Azoth or something? You can't just make a bunch of Azoth weapons? Yeah, you can, can you? Crafting one of six. There we go. And then we'll just pick one. From the bunch. Harvesting experience, harvesting experience, harvesting experience. Durability, durability. I guess we'll go with harvesting experience because we need to level it up. I think durability doesn't really matter. I think durability is pretty good if you uh, if you already are maxed out. All right, so there we go. Got a new sickle. Um, so which sickle we were using this one, right? And then we'll get rid of this one. And then for the knife. Do 
Should we go with the yield or the Azoth extraction? I think we'll go with Azoth extraction. We're going to be using a lot of Azoth, so... Let's get rid of all of these. Okay. So I guess we'll uh, check out the mining picks now. No, you don't really need one. Yeah, we'll make like seven, I guess. Hopefully we get lucky. Takes a while to level up your engineering, though. I wonder if there's like a faster way. Well, actually, it's not bad. We're getting like a level every couple. It seems like the mining picks really level it up. We're apprentice engineer now. Okay, so we have a 240 here. Durability. Don't really care for that. Azoth extraction. I think we'll probably stick with... Yeah, we'll go... we're going to start farming Azoth. Luck's pretty good. Luck's okay. But I think we'll stick with uh, the Azoth extraction. So we'll use this now. I guess we'll keep the mining luck one. It doesn't hurt. I, can't... I guess we'll not. We'll get rid of it. And... Um... Here, we have all these to get rid of. It's too bad we won't be using these. There we go. And let's check out the axes. I think our axe is alright. Nah, we can get a better one. Okay, so let's check out the axes here. Let's get some maze off in there. And we'll max it out. We'll see what we get. Hopefully we get lucky. Smart that they added this. People love doing this. Well, I like doing it. I think we got lucky there. Reminds me of Diablo when you're trying to get, like, a certain item with, like, certain stats on it. You can do this all day, just hopefully hoping you get lucky. So Azoth Extraction, that's a good one. Logging luck. Most likely going to go with the Azoth Extraction. 245. Let's get rid of all these. And there we go, guys. Level 29 from that. We actually leveled up from crafting. It's kind of interesting. Alright, so let's head back to... Oh, we got talent upgrade here. I wonder if we should go into strength or constitution. I think we'll go into constitution. Get a little bit more health. Alright, so let's put away some stuff. And then we will head up and maybe we'll do a couple PvP quests and farm some uh, some wood or get out there and farm a bit. So we have used up a half of our storage. It's not too bad. We still have a lot of stuff to use still. I don't have too much food. Maybe that'd be a good thing to do. Make a couple of travel rations. Okay. See how many of these we can make. Six. Imagine you could get lucky with food. That'd be kind of funny. Like, if you meet, like, some food's better than the others. Like, this, this food sucks. <laughs> this food tastes like crap. <laughs> Let's throw it out. We'll, meet, we'll make even more. Like, why not? Make a bunch. I wonder if there's anything better than travel ration. There probably is. Yeah, we have a lot of travel ra oh, sand flux. How many travel rations we got now? 46. It's a decent amount. Okay. All right, so let's get out there. We will now, uh, we're done crafting. Our bags are not as full. We got our professions up a little bit. And now we'll uh, do a little bit of PvP questing. Give it a little bit of XP. We're almost 30. And then once we hit 30, we'll be able to go and uh, continue the main story quest chain again. Which is what I'm looking forward to, because it was just getting good, and they're like, oh, sorry, you gotta be 30. 
Let us endeavor to bring victory to the Marauders. All right, so there we go. We picked up a bunch of quests. It's supposed to be level 30, but I think we get like a, a new faction set that we can unlock, I, th I believe. So that might be a good thing to do as well. Okay, so we got to... Where are we heading? Oh, man. We can do, do, do these two, I guess. I think that might be a good idea. Let's do these two. Three and four. We'll hold it for one minute, and then we got to retrieve the asset. And we'll farm a bit. I wonder if we can leave the settlement from up here. Don't think you can. I've never actually been back here. Interested to see if you can actually leave. Looks like you can. This is like the back route. Oh my gosh. Our hands are broken. I probably should have made some gloves. Maybe we'll do that later. All right, so we're back. And we just have to go across here. I wonder what that sound is. Oh, look at these gators. Okay. Getting a little too close there. Well, everything here is like really just high level. What am I doing? Am I going the right way? No. This is to a very dangerous place. I remember going this to that island. <laughs> Gotta stay away. These guys can like one shot us. Or two shot us at least. Let's make sure we just don't get shot. Run! So we gotta go over here. Still chasing me? Okay, good. Yeah, I've been shot by those guys before. And they took me to like 25% health. So this is where we're supposed to be, right here. pick up this asset. Oh, there we go. Now where's the other thirds over there? So I guess we'll go do four right now. We'll hold East Swarna Beach for a bit. what the level of everything is here? Like seven? Really? And there it is. East Warna Beach. I wonder why people want to hold this. Like, what's so good about this spot? It's like no trees, nothing, there's nothing to gather. <laughs> Maybe there's iron. I 
Alright, so I guess we'll hang out here for another six seconds. And then we have to make our way back to the other side. Oh, we got to sit here for a while. So what do we... I guess we'll just pick up Flint. The best hold missions are when there, where there's, like, trees or something to, like, gather. Or if there's somebody to fight. We'll get as much flint as we can. We got 20 seconds. Looks like the sun's coming up. Looks pretty cool. All right, three, two, one here. There we go. Did it. All right, so now we just got to get back on the other side. Find this, uh, this asset here. It's like a pretty peaceful place. Not much going on. No, no pirates. But the thing is, you go to the other side of the map, or the other that place over there, it's pretty brutal. I wonder what zone, like, level that zone is. Probably, like, 40-plus, I'd say. Hmm. Some lost here. Just two-shotting those guys now. So I guess Monarch Bluffs is probably, uh... I'm feeling it's, like, way too low of a, of a zone, probably, to do these quests. Yeah, it's probably better for me to be in Brightwood, actually. right over there. Devil's Sea Ark. I wonder if we have to go climb up here to get it. I have a feeling we might have to. Oh, no, it's right down here. There we go. Got the proof of delivery. We access the contents, and now it's. We'll go back, turn these in. I'm gonna try to farm some stuff on the way, though. And yeah, I think these uh, quests are too low. Wow, we can't. That's a mature tree. It's a shame we can't cut those down yet. I just wonder what level we're at. We're almost 50, so once we hit 50, we'll be able to uh, chop those trees down. Would be good to catch logging up to mining and chop these you know, young tree. Got some Azoth for that, not bad. See what our skinning knife gives us. We got a new skinning knife here. Yeah, Monarch Bluff's way too low of a level for us. So yeah, the Azos seems to add up. You seem to get the procs pretty frequently. Like, almost every other tree chopped down, you get, like, one Azoth. It's not bad. So after, like, 30 trees, 
pretty much got your, uh, your Azoth back from crafting the axe. She's probably less than that. It's probably like 45 to 60 trees. Yeah, one day we'll get up to mature. Eventually. <laughs> We'll get there. I wonder what's like the best axe in the game. Or like what's the best material for making axes. So we're going to have to move up from iron eventually. Taking us a decent amount of time just to chop these trees down. The young trees. Like, I can imagine the mature ones taking, like, a long time. So you probably need to farm a better material for a better axe. Okay, so let's head up here. We can go this way, right? And turn these two quests in. We are strongest together. Let us endeavor to bring victory to the marauders. Not bad. I got a little bit. We have how, how much? Uh, or we almost have a token cap. So I need to watch out for that. Might have to buy something before we do another PvP quest. The thing is, I want to hit 30. Because if we hit 30, then we can start using that token to purchase um, the faction gear. Yeah, guys. I'm going to call the episode here. I think next episode we'll probably go to Brightwood again and then do some uh, questing there. And hopefully we hit 30 and can return to the main story quest chain. But as always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.